our dad left. But then like he he kind of like came back and tried like to get back in to what he used to be, but like it wasn't working. And so um we had to like place a restraining order cuz some stuff he did wasn't like what we want him to do as a father. It was a six year restraining order and it's a good six years, I guess. We didn't go to church for a while because like stuff was happening. He took our stuff when he left, like not even legally. So it was like difficult. We needed to find a new house, find a way to get like money and like transportation and everything. I like started reading my Bible again. I went to my mom, asked, what's this about? how did I get it? She told me I got baptized as a kid. It wasn't like really a faith at that time because I was like, I liked the stories and stuff. And so then for the first time in like a few years, we went to church and I learned more, got to know new people. During the six years, I kept thinking like, why isn't our dad here? Why isn't he like with us and stuff? And so like, that's when I found the Bible and I started reading it. I grew up in like all these schools and they're filled with like rich people and stuff. Most of these kids were atheists and so they kept like pushing my faith down over and over. And so then it was like kind of hard diminishing that um that faith. But then we kept going to church and kept going to church and kept going to church and it kind of like grew back to me and I realized why like I like the Bible so much why I'm with God so much. I needed somebody bigger. That's basically why because Hi mom, she's tough, she's great. But um I needed somebody way big like way bigger, way, way, way bigger. And so I found God. From the point where I started my life and got like baptized as a child. I think that like I've gotten more um stubborn about my faith and I think that's a good thing. My name's Jadir and I I decided to follow Jesus. Yeah.